Stevenson gets the 40 to 18 win over Alvernia to improve to 3 and 0 on the season. Glenn Clark with head coach Ed Hoddle. Coach, your defense for the second straight week in the second half was nails. What are you saying in the locker room at halftime? And how do you bottle that up to get it for 60 minutes? Well, and that's you know that's what we talked about, right? You know that was not our best half of football in any phase of the game. And you know we talked about it at halftime. You know we kind of go back to practice this week. We were a little lethargic at times, and um, you know I think guys just you know locked it in and you know got, started to focus and, and execute the game plan. And you know hats off to those guys for sure. It was, you know, let's talk a little bit about that. Alvernia, obviously a program that's on the rise, new head coach. Was it difficult this week after an emotional win to try to convey to these guys, hey, this isn't the same Alvernia. We, we've got to be ready to go on Saturday. Well, it's, it's interesting, you know, if you go back to uh, Nick Saban's comments earlier in the week, mm -hmm. if you watched that press conference, you know, we actually showed the guys that last night, you know, talking about respect winning, respect your opponent, you know, and, and you've got to have a great week of work. And, you know, we didn't have a great week of work. And I think there was a little bit of hangover from last week. And um, but, you know, good football teams can't allow that to affect your performance on Saturday. So I think we've got some room to grow there, some things to, to work on and get better from, which is, you know, the goal every week. It's one thing to be a good defense. It's a different thing to be a big play defense. Your defense has made big play after big play this season. I don't know that you can always count on that or rely on it, but how much better is a football team when you're getting those types of game-changing plays from your defense? Yeah, when you when you take the ball away and, and, and generate uh, generate takeaways and you know get those big plays, it certainly helps you know from an emotional perspective. But again, you, you're right; we don't want to rely on that. Um, you know, we've got to be in a pretty steady space emotionally, and you know, go out and do our job. And you know, it's it's fun to watch. It's you know, nice to see the guys having a great time, right? But you know, you've got to kind of you, you got to steady the ship and know you're, you're probably gonna have to go back out there. So you've got to get into that right mental space. And you know, our guys are young and, and they're growing, and, and it's it's great to see them having fun out there. You know, another week, another milestone for Ryan. He goes over 500 career completions. He's now next week, obviously, going to break the career passing yards record here at Stevenson. Um, the big one for me today was you put him back in there in that first drive of the second half, and you got the third and goal. Um, you know, somebody just being thrown into there, hey, we need you to go convert this to get a touchdown in this spot. What do you say about a player who's ready to go? And, again, the catch from Amir I thought was spectacular on that play. Yeah, Amir, was, that, that was a great catch. That was probably one of the best catches of his career. Um, you know, the quarterback thing, you know, those guys are competing every day. We thought that Nye, you know, made, made enough plays in practice. We'd give him a couple of opportunities. And, you know, some of them he did really well, and some of them you saw some of the youth. So, um, you know, Ryan's a, Ryan's a pro in, in a sense from, you know, an experience perspective. And, and he understands that, you know, we've got to kind of start to develop the next guy, you know, here and there. And um, he knows when, you know, his number's called called again, he's going to be, you know, he's going to be that guy. And, and, you know, we appreciate that attitude, that willingness to work. That was a big play. Coach, congratulations on a win on a 3-0 start. Best of luck on the road next week. Thanks very much. He's Ed Hoddle. I'm Glenn Clark. GoMustangSports.tv.